how to create a brand account in YouTube. Well, that's what I'm going to show you guys, and it's a pretty quick and easy tutorial. So if this video helps you out, please do let me know in the comments. But um, yeah, let's get started. So what I recommend, though, is to watch this video all the way to the end, because I will actually explain everything in detail. And there is actually one step that if you do it wrong, you could actually possibly delete your YouTube channel, which I've actually also experienced. Uh, it took me about two weeks to get it back. I actually DM'd the YouTube Twitter, so you can actually get it back, but it's actually a complete problem. And uh, like you do not want to experience that. But if you watch my video, this should not happen. So I over here have this YouTube channel. It's with this profile picture. I just added a quick profile picture to show you guys like it will be a little bit more like easier to understand. So you want to go to the settings and here you want to click on add or manage your channels. And here you actually want to create another channel besides this one. And um, I'll just name this um, like this. And, I'm, and then I'll click on create. Sometimes you actually have to verify your account. Um, like I just have to, a lot of the times you don't, but yeah. So I now have two accounts over here. If you click on this, you can see uh, it is the second channel. And then this is the main channel. Now, what you will basically do is move your main channel to like the second channel and then it will turn into a brand account. So in order to do that, you first of all want to make sure that you have selected your main channel. Because if you select your main channel, you will basically delete or like overwrite your second channel and then this channel will turn into a brand account. If you select this channel, then you will basically do the opposite. So you will delete or overwrite your main channel. And that is not what you want to do because that is actually what I have done by mistake in the past. So you want to make sure that you've selected your main account. And once you have done that, you want to click on here again, open up the settings. And then you want to click on view advanced settings over here. Now here you actually want to click on move channel to a brand account. Once you click on there, um, you will first of all have to enter a password and then you'll be brought to this page and it says choose an account to move channel to. So that's the account that we have just created. You want to click on replace. So if you click on there, it will say this. Delete this channel. Here's the channel that will be deleted. By moving your channel, you'll permanently delete this channel that is currently connected to the account. So this channel. So if you see um, your own profile picture, so this one and your name in here instead of the second channel, then you want to make sure that you are on the correct account. So then it says, blah, blah, blah. I understand and wish to proceed. So delete channel. Then it says, are you sure you want to move and update your channel? Um, this will this is what will happen. Then move channel. And then it says YouTube channel has been successfully moved. It may take up to 10 minutes to update, uh, blah, blah, blah. So that's basically what you've done. Now, if you click on here and click on switch to account, you can now see that this one is now at the bottom and this one is now at the top. So this one now says no channel because, you know, this uh, is now completely gone. Now, if we click on this one, this is now actually our uh, branded channel. Now, if you want to find out if that is actually true, then click on um, YouTube Studio. You can like double check it. If you go to the settings and then to permissions, then it says keep managing permissions in your brand account. Normally this would look like this, so you can like manage it inside the YouTube studio, but for brand accounts, it looks like this. And then you can click on manage permissions. Then you'll be brought to this page and here you can actually manage your permissions. That's how you can create a brand account in YouTube. I hope this video helped you out and let me know in the comments if it did. And then I'll see you next time.